Hey, this is Steve with Dabble Lab, and in this video, I am going to show you how to create an Alexa skill that plays a, an audio feed. So we're going to be using the audio player interface, and we're going to do this using a template that I created and published out on skilltemplates.com. If you haven't used templates yet uh, or templates from skill templates, you can go to skilltemplates.com and then go over to getting started here, and there's all of the, uh, the prerequisites and what you need to, uh, to make this all work. But basically, you need uh, an Amazon developer account, you need an AWS account, and you need the Alexa Skills Kit CLI installed. And once you have all of that stuff, you can use the, um, the Skills Kit CLI to grab the template. So you would go ask new and then template like this, and then the URL to the template feed for skill templates, which is HTTP slash slash skill templates. Uh, T-M-P-L-A-T-E-S dot com and then slash templates dot JSON, plural JSON, can't type. Okay, just like that. And that is going to go grab a list of available templates. There's just a few of them right now, but the one that we want to uh, grab for today's video is this one here, the audio stream starter. So you select that and it will pull down the skill project and it will um, put it in the folder wherever you ran that command. In my case here, I'm running it in this uh, temp folder here. So once you have the, um, the skill project folder, you've got everything you need to go ahead and deploy this skill with the, um, the ask CLI. So you would just move into, oops, you just move into um, that folder. So. this and then you would just go ask deploy like that and that's going to push it out to the Amazon developer portal and then it's going to um, push the lambda function out to the Amazon web uh, services and this takes a minute because it also builds the interaction model and that takes a bit so I'm going to go ahead and pause and then I'll come back and show you how it all works okay so after the deployment process finishes up, then you can go and log into your developer council. And uh, if you if you just created your developer account and you don't have any Alexa skills, you'll see this uh, audio stream starter skill, which is the one that we just published. And uh, once you log in, you go to Alexa and then the Alexa skills kit, and then you'll see this list here. And then all you need to do at this point to test it out is to go into the skill uh, configuration and then go to test or to the skill details and then go to test and then enable testing here. Uh, because it's using the audio player directives, you can't use the test simulator to test this or it won't test or it won't work with the uh, audio uh, player directives right now. So you, you do to test actually in this case, because we're streaming audio, need to uh, to test with an Alexa-enabled device like an Amazon Echo, and that is what I'm going to do right now. So I'm going to turn on my Echo. Alexa, open audio stream starter. Enjoy. And so right now, I just have it pointed out to a uh, an alternative radio station feed, and that's what you're listening to right now. But all of the audio player. We are taking a break so, to pick them more Alexa, pause. Call. Alexa, okay. stop. Okay, I've stopped the stream. And all of the uh, the audio controls are in there. So now let's um, let's take a look at the uh, the code. So back over here, and um, in the skill project here, uh, if you the the back end the lambda code, if you go into lambda here. What I tried to do, there's a lot of really good examples of uh, audio player skills. If you go search GitHub, there's lots of them out there. And uh, there's a, a good one on the um, the Amazon uh, Alexa GitHub repo as well. But all of the ones that I was looking at are, were pretty complex. And uh, I really wanted this one to just kind of be a, a simple starting point. So there's no custom node modules. It's it's really just pretty uh, pretty vanilla. Um, but I think, uh, or I hope anyway, that it provides a, a good starting point and a way for you to sort of wrap your head around how this all works. 
if you're trying to learn uh, how to get a, a, an audio streaming skill working, you can, if you, I mean, you can just use this if you're just wanting a simple skill that plays one stream, you can just change this up here, uh, change the, you know, the, the, this information, the title and the subtitle and card content to whatever you want it to be. And most importantly, the URL here. So this is the URL to the, uh, the audio stream that you want to play. And this needs to be HTTPS. That's uh, the only requirement. And then if um, uh, there's a card that gets served up when uh, uh, you, uh, you play this, and if you want to change the images, you would change that here. Other than that, um, the only other thing, well, actually there's two things. So if you go to this skill.json file, all of the configuration information for the skill is in here. So all of the stuff that would be out here in uh, the developer um, uh, council is in there. So you can change that all up, including the logos or the icons, these things here, you uh, point those to whatever images that, uh, that you want to use there. And the last thing that you might want to change up if you just want to change it to use it for your own purposes is this here, going to the, um, the configuration. Uh, I'm sorry, not that. You don't need to change that. Uh, the model go here and you'll probably want to change this, the invocation name. This is the name that's going to start it up. So if we wanted to change this to like my alternative, uh, well, I'll uh, just leave it my alternative radio. So if I wanted to change the invocation name, how it starts up, I would change that there. And then back down here, you can just go ask um, deploy again. And this is going to push the updates out. And I'll go ahead and do that and just show you the, the uh, difference. It'll take a second. So I will pause and come back. Okay, so now all of my um, changes are deployed. So now I should be able to ask Alexa to open my alternative radio to get my radio uh, feed, my stream. Let's see. Alexa, open my alternative radio. Alexa, open my alternative radio. Enjoy. There we go. Let's work it. Alexa, pause. Okay, I've stopped the stream. Alexa, resume. Enjoy. Okay, so Alexa, stop. Alexa, stop. Okay, I've stopped the stream. Okay, so that is it. That is a super simple... Um, uh, Alexa audio streaming example. So if you've Sorry, got any questions, I don't know that one. if you've got any questions or comments, this video, if you're watching it from the skilltemplates.com site, is also on uh, youtube.com slash Dabalab, the Dabalab channel on YouTube. And you can leave questions there. And I try to respond to those as quickly as possible. If, uh, if you found the video valuable, please like it and uh, subscribe to the Dabalab channel. Thanks so much.